Hey hi everyone this is Mukesh Otwani once again from learn-machine.com Today in this video we are going to talk about method overloading in Selenium So basically if you are attending interviews for automation and if you have mentioned Selenium then you can expect this question The question can be explain how do you use method overloading in your framework or you can expect this question that explain method overloading concept via Selenium or tell me certain scenarios where you have used method overloading in Selenium. So once is very straightforward, I will give you three different examples. But once you go through Selenium, once you go through Selenium web driver, basically, you will notice many places you will see method overloading concept. Okay. Now, let me first show you what exactly is method overloading. So those who are completely new to Java, then I would highly recommend you to watch the previous recordings where I explained what is overloading. Okay, so in simple terms, it's part of polymorphism. So whenever you talk about OOPS concept, polymorphism is one of the most important concept. Here we have overloading and we have overriding. In this video, we are focusing on overloading that to method overloading. In the next video, I will talk about constructor overloading. In method overloading, we will overload the method and in the constructor will overload the constructor similarly when it comes to overriding we'll talk about method overriding that too in a different video not in this video now the moment you talk about overloading in simple terms when you see one method or constructor in multiple forms one thing in multiple forms which is basically polymorphism overloading means we are using same method multiple times with different signature okay so same method or constructor with different signature so when i say signature it means number of arguments then type of argument and then order of argument don't worry if you stick to this video till the end i will explain all of this through examples with selenium so that you can explain in interviews so when you see one method or constructor with different signature, signature means number of arguments, type of arguments and order of arguments, we say as a method overloading. The question is, how do you use overloading concept in Selenium or where do you use overloading with Selenium? Let me show you now. So for this, I will create a sample class. I will say method overloading in Selenium. <coughs> Now I'm using public static void main, but you can use at the test annotation with JUnit or test engine. So in order to start, I need web driver. So let me quickly start web driver. So web driver driver called a new Chrome driver. First example, the moment you use switch to command, notice here, we have frame method. So basically, this is another interview question that we can discuss explain switch to command so we have switch to frame switch to window and switch to alerts now notice here the frame method is coming three times right switch to frame switch to frame switch to frame method name is same but if you notice type of argument is different first of all number of argument is one 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 this one is accepting index this one accepting string, this one accepting web element. So number of argument one, but type of argument is different. Here it says type you have to pass as an integer index. Second one says name or ID. Third one says web element. Perfect example for method overloading in Selenium web driver. You can explain in the same way that whenever we switch to a frame, we have a frame method which is overloaded why we say overloaded because we have different ways to switch to a frame either index or name and id or using web element stick to this example now i'm assuming if you're watching this interview series then you must be familiar but if you're not familiar i would highly recommend before jumping into interview questions go through the concept first second example which you can <coughs> explain is actions class so actions class basically in Selenium, we use whenever we have to perform advanced activities like drag and drop, keyboard activities, mouse activities, mouse over, right? Now if you notice here, 
click method click method is overloaded so if you notice here click method with zero argument click method with one argument number of arguments are different method is same but arguments are different method overloading notice another example click and hold click and hold zero argument one argument context click zero argument one argument double click zero argument one argument so method overloading again you can explain using actions class you can mention uh, we have used action class in our project and in actions class we have multiple methods which are overloaded like context click right click sorry context click double click simple click method this click method will simply click on the current mouse location and if you use the second method click with web element if you pass web element it will go to that web element and click second example third example which you can explain is javascript executor so if you type javascript executor let me type cast and again guys for javascript executor i have multiple videos so i would highly recommend you to watch now if you notice this method called execute script right so second method and third method second method says you pass two argument one is script key and key second argument object where x variable in the argument can you see dot 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 same method execute a script name is same number of argument same two and two but type is different here it says first argument is script key and object variable length argument here is you pass string script and object variable length argument method overloading in selenium if you give this three example more than enough they will get enough idea and they can move to the next question okay so once you start working in selenium please notice methods and which methods are overloaded and make a note so that in future if you come across uh, multiple examples you will have more examples to discuss in your interview yeah so i hope you got the concept of method overloading in selenium web driver let me quickly summarize how you can explain yes we have used uh, selenium web driver and we're using java and we have seen multiple examples of method overloading in selenium so while switching to frame we have frame method while using actions class we have multiple method which is overloaded and while using javascript executor we have method which is overloaded so it depends on the argument which we pass the respect to method is getting called yeah so this is how you can explain method overloading now in the next video i will explain you if you get a question explain constructor overloading in selenium or explain constructor overloading which you have used in your current project how you can explain yeah so that's all about this video if you find this video helpful then please share with your friends colleagues and if you're new to this channel then don't forget to subscribe this channel if you have any question in the mind let me know in the comment section and i will take it in the next video thank you so much have a nice day bye bye